What's up guys, this is Lesh Legend from Tech Ramen. In this video we got a cleaning bot and this one is from iRobo. In a country where we have a startup book my boy offering maids on hire and maids are integral family member of many households, one might dismiss iRobo as a fancy product. But India is changing and after using the iRobo Roomba 870 for a fortnight now, I think vacuum cleaning robots could soon make way into many households, especially in urban cities. There are increasing number of working couple households who find it difficult to manage theirs and maids timings and then even finding the right house helpers are increasingly becoming difficult as well as costlier. Then there are also those clean freaks who would like a second round of cleaning later the day. For all those, iRobo Roomba would be a perfect help and here is why. iRobo, a popular household name in America and Europe, officially started its operation in India a few months back with their own stores as well as an e-commerce platform in their Indian website. The iRobo offers vacuum cleaning as well as mopping bots. In India, they are currently offering their 600, 700 and 800 series of vacuum cleaning bots and the price starts at Rs. 32,900. What we got in this video is the iRobo Roomba 870 and let's get going with the review. So, out of the box, you get the Roomba machine, a docking station, a power car, two vertical wall units, a spare filter, four AA batteries for the vertical walls, and a user manual and a quick guide. Across the series, the iRobo Roomba has a distinctive circular design. While the 600 series have predominant white color on the body, the 700 and 800 series have opted for the black gray shades that work better visually. The Roomba is a sturdy device and it has to be as it collides with the wall and furniture when prowling to gather dirt. A handle at the top makes it easy to carry around. The top face display has four buttons, dock, clock, schedule and spot. The scheduler can set the timer for each day of the week for the Roomba to automatically go about its work on the scheduled time. And there is also a bin release button and a room, room confinement sensor on the top. There is a large clean power button that glows in green. And on the bottom side there are three pairs of clip sensors, spinning side brush, debris extractors, removable coaster wheel two sturdy wheel module. Usually most of the uh, vacuum cleaning boards comes with the bristle brushes. iRobo introduced the Aeroforce technology first in the 800 series and replaced the bristle brushes with the ro rubber rollers. The company says it cleans up 50% more dirt, hair and debris. Aeroforce is essentially a two threaded rubber rollers that spin in opposite directions. The treads are angled and it enhances the sucking power of the airflow by creating a sealed channel on the floor. It is also tangleless with long hairs, pet hairs and threads when compared to the bristle brushes. The extractors can be easily removed for cleaning and easily snaps back in position. There is a side spinning wheel which helps to dig out the dirt from the edges as well as sweep the dirt around the path of the Roomba for it to clean efficiently. The dustbin is small and it can be easily released by a press of a button and snap back. On the top, there is a lid that covers the filter. The bin can get quickly filled. I have to empty it every 4-5 days but it depends on how messy your house is. The cleaner bot is very simple to use. When the bot is powered off, first press of the clean button brings it to life and you see the green glow. A second press sends it to cleaning. Similarly, when it is working, pressing the clean button pauses it and a long button shuts it down. The robo is intelligent too. When the battery is on low charge, it automatically finds its way back to the docking station to recharge. There is also a regular cleaning and spot mode. The spot mode instructs the vacuum to focus on a particular area. Out of the box, you get two virtual walls units. So what it does? If you want to create a virtual barrier to block a particular area or room, you can just place the virtual box to create a fence. It works well. It's kind of a geofencing. The clip sensors work brilliantly. The first time I used, my heart skipped a bit when it approached the edge of the stairs, but it stopped, turned and continued its cleaning edge. Accessing difficult to reach areas like under the cart are easy with Roomba. 
It waited under my cot, coffee tables and furniture smoothly and does not complain. While Roomba is easy to use, it can test your patience too, if you are in a hurry. While it can sense the time it needs to clean the room and then hit the docking station once the job is done, at times it takes its own pace. It follows an algorithm to cover as much ground as possible, but while you see a dirt a few feet away from the Roomba, it can skip it, go to the other corner and lazily return after some time to clean the dirt. But it does the job. Having said that, the dirt sensor can sometimes disappoint by half cleaning at one area and thinking it was done. It can also gobble up the food spills. I was surprised it slurped the pomegranate juice that was dripped down my flow along with other bits and pieces of kitchen waste. If you have a large carpet area, you would appreciate Roomba. It does a fantastic job at sucking out the hidden dirt. I don't have a cat or dog as pet, so I took the Roomba to a friend's place to check how it handles the pet's hair. Unless you have a long haired dogs, you shouldn't be having much of an issue. Long hairs can occasionally tangle into the extractors needing your attention. Though in my testing period, I faced no such instances barring once. The Roomba also needs a periodic maintenance. The extractors and sensors needs to be cleaned. The dustbin of course has to be emptied when it is full. Fortunately, there is an indicator including a voice one that says the bin is full. So on a final note, to be honest, it was my first attempt at testing an automatic vacuum. Roomba stuck a positive note with me. Yes, the traditional vacuum cleaners offers a better suction power, but the Roomba frees your time. When used regularly, the Roomba can keep your home pretty cleaner. But it comes with a little higher price. At this price, it will be a luxury for many and I have no plans of retiring my maid. For those who can afford it, the Roomba can be one happy cleaning pot. It has a good comeback design, solid build quality and impressive performance. So that's about the iRobo Roomba cleaning pot. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you like our video, give us a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel for more updates from us and stay tuned. This is Lesh Rajat signing off for Tech Raman. Have a great day. See you in the next video.